<laughs> the reason the train goes so fast is because of magnetic levitation. Levitation? I thought that was because of magic. It's not magic, it's physics. Powerful superconducting electromagnets in the train interact with coils in the track, producing repulsive magnetic force that lifts the train. That's the levitation. And no contact between the train and the track means no friction, which means it goes much faster. So what is a superconducting electromagnet? A superconducting electromagnet is made by running current through a superconducting wire wrapped in a coil. And it gets extremely high currents. Ordinary wires heat up when current flows, but superconductors have no resistance, so when the current flows, there's no energy losses, and that's why we get such strong magnets. Superconductors only work at extremely low temperatures once we reach below a critical temperature, and we cool the superconducting wire down by using liquid nitrogen or helium. When the train is moving, these superconducting magnets induce a current in the coils in the track, and according to Lenz's law, the magnetic field then created in these coils in the track opposes that that caused it. And that's why then we get these two north poles that will repel each other. The reason the train goes forward is because these coils in the track alternate, causing both the train to be pushed forward from the repulsion and then pulled forward from the attraction at the other end. Follow me for more physics content like this.